In Connecticut, most kids are now back in the classroom, but some aren't showing up at all, not even virtually. Now a new program hopes to reach them. Here in Meriden, 8% of students aren't even showing up. I am proud to be a teacher. History teacher Lauren Mancini Averett told Governor Lamont she spends hours tracking down her own students. I've had students who sign on every day and do what I ask them to do, and I have students who we cannot find or see. That's why Connecticut is pouring $10 million in federal relief money at the problem. In Meriden, Bridgeport, Stamford, and a dozen other districts, teams will go door to door reaching out to parents. You know, you can't do it all by online, you can't do it even all by telephone. You still have to knock on doors. Since COVID began, chronic absenteeism has almost doubled, especially among kids with disabilities and housing issues. I mean, how bad is this problem? Enough for us to be concerned. Connecticut's new education commissioner says they want to work with parents. There are issues. You know, some of it may be connectivity. Some of it, some of it may be just uh, needing to work with, uh, you know, parents. This summer, even more money is headed Connecticut's way in President Biden's American Rescue Plan. Teachers say it will help. I think it will make a huge impact if we can engage the families then the kids are going to come back. So what will school look like this fall? The new state education commissioner says stay tuned. She'll have an update in about a month. In Meriden, John Craven, News 12, Connecticut.